everybody, this is Noah from FrenchPressReviews.com. Should you use a French press? If you're new to the idea of a French press coffee maker, you might be wondering if you should make the switch from your normal everyday automatic drip machine. Well, there's a couple considerations that you really have to think about. That includes how much coffee you drink, the taste that you really like, and how much of an investment you'd like to make. First, just a little bit of information about a French press. The process involved in preparing your coffee with one of these coffee makers is different than preparing it with a drip machine. With a French press, you'll actually be mixing coffee grounds and hot water together inside of the device, and then you use a special filter called a plunger to push all of the grounds down to the bottom of it, and that strains the water past all of the grounds and creates a really rich tasting coffee that's not like anything that you've had before. So the first consideration that you have to think about, how much coffee do you drink? Some coffee drinkers will make a single pot of coffee and drink the whole thing within just a few hours. Other people will take an entire day just to drink about half of a pot. A French press doesn't make as much coffee as a drip machine usually does. So the amount of coffee that you drink is a really important consideration when you're trying to decide if you should start using a French press instead. Most presses are measured in European cups and they'll measure out to creating 4, 8, 10, and sometimes 12 European cups per use. A European cup is half the size of a standard American cup, so if your French press makes 12 European cups per use, really, you'll be getting about 6 American cups. That's about 4 coffee mugs full. An automatic drip machine usually makes about 10 American cups, maybe even 12. The second consideration is what kind of coffee taste do you like? The most important thing to most coffee drinkers is the taste. If you really enjoy the taste that you get from an automatic drip machine, then the answer to should I use a French press might be no. If you're happy, why switch? However, if you find that you're creating something a bit more strong than you would like, then you might want to check out a French press. A lot of people think that the coffee that they get from a drip machine is acidic tasting or bitter and usually you don't get that kind of response when you drink coffee from a French press because the coffee grounds and water sit together while it's brewing for a number of minutes more of those gentle flavors and aromas are extracted into the water and that makes a more bold tasting coffee now it's not more bold as in it's stronger and more bitter it's bold in the sense that the coffee taste is more present so if you really like the taste of coffee you'll probably enjoy the taste that you get from a French press. Another thing that a lot of coffee drinkers like about using a press is that there's no paper filter. A lot of drinkers think that a coffee filter in a drip machine will actually transfer some flavor into their coffee, which would be a negative thing. If you think that using a paper filter is changing the taste of your coffee, you should try to give a French press a try because they don't use paper filters. The final consideration that you have to think about is what kind of investment do you want to make? Whether you use an automatic drip machine or a French press, there are models at different levels and ranges of prices. Generally speaking, a French press will just be a little bit more expensive than a drip machine when you consider how much coffee they make. However, it's important to remember that a press will usually last for years and years, while a lot of drip machines only last for about a year or two. So over the long term, a French press might actually be a better investment. So overall, if you're asking whether or not you should switch to a French press, chances are good that you're not really satisfied with the coffee that you have now. So if you want a more rich and bold and full taste in your coffee every morning and then throughout the day, I would suggest that you try out a French press coffee maker. If you want to learn more about coffee and French press devices, check out www.frenchpressreviews.com.